Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. So it's already the end of January and I have yet to do a proper curly hair routine, a proper wash day routine. I just have not been taking care of my curly hair. It was straight for a long time and then I just been keeping it in braids or bubble braids and just random twists and I just, it's gonna end today. Today we're doing a proper curly hair routine with the help of Verge Beauty. So this video is sponsored by Verge Beauty. Verge Beauty is a hair care company and retailer that simplifies the process of choosing high quality hair care products Products and creating functional routines. So on the Verge Beauty website, you can find products and tools from all different brands. So it makes it a super easy and convenient way to shop. They have tons of different products for different hair concerns, scalp care needs, and even personalized quizzes that will help you choose the products that are perfect for you. Okay, so I'm taking these braids out before I get in the shower, and today I'm actually gonna try out some new products I've never tried before. So I got everything that I need for a complete curly hair routine from Verge Beauty, and I'll link every product that I use today in the description box below if you are interested. I think it's important to have a proper and consistent hair care routine to get the best results and to take the best care of your hair. You don't always have to use the same exact products. I like to switch up the different styling products that I use, but there are certain things that I just always do when I do my curly hair routines that give me the best results so today I'm gonna show you a full routine and we're gonna see how I take my hair from looking like this to getting my actual curls back because this is a mess this is not it I think I even have a bobby pin lost in here somewhere there it goes it's probably been in there for weeks but I'm about to jump in the shower go use some of my new products and I'll be right back So this vitamin C shower filter that I installed is for scalp and body and it removes chlorine and water impurities, it moisturizes skin and hair, improves skin texture and provides scent therapy. And I have to say this was probably the best shower that I've had in a long time. This shower filter is one of those products that you don't know you need until you have it and it's something that I want to continue to use in my curly hair routines, in my shower routines in general. I have the Blossom Bliss scent so there's many other scents on the website I believe and I can't wait to try out some new ones. So for my cleanser, I'm using the curly shampoo from the brand Truce or Trust. I'm not exactly sure what the correct pronunciation is, but it's a deep treatment for curly and wavy hair. I really loved the consistency of this shampoo. I was able to get a really good lather going and I feel like I had a good deep clean of my scalp and my hair. And this shampoo was created to enhance curls, softness, elasticity, and shine. I also believe that these Truce brand products are Brazilian products, which I've heard so many good things about Brazilian hair care. So before I rinse out my shampoo, I'm going in with one of my favorite hair tools ever, and that is a scalp massager. This one is from the brand Dream Box Beauty. It has these flexible rubber prongs that help give you a deep cleanse and remove any buildup on your scalp and stimulate your scalp for hair growth. This is something that you need to add into your routine. I promise you, if you want any kind of hair growth, you need a scalp massager. So if you don't have one, definitely go pick one up. I'll leave the link in the description box for this one specifically if you wanna check it out. So after I rinse out my shampoo, I'm going in with my curly conditioner from the same brand and it is a deep treatment for curly and wavy hair as well. The conditioner also enhances curls, softness, elasticity, and shine. So I raked this through all of my hair and then I did let it sit on my hair for a few minutes before I washed my body, did the rest of my shower routine. So I'm out the shower now and I have my hair wrapped up in my new microfiber towel. This is the Kish quick drying hair towel that can be used on any kind of hair, curly, straight, wavy. It's highly absorbent and it helps prevent frizz and reduce drying time when you're doing your hair. I always use a microfiber towel. I really like this one though because it does have this elastic band that keeps it super secure on your head and then also the little button up here that makes it super easy to wrap up the end. But I'm gonna take my hair out of this and go ahead and start detangling. 
feeling it. My hair honestly feels so good right now. It's so soft. My scalp feels nice and refreshed. And I think it has a lot, a lot, a lot to do with that shower filter. I love everything that I've tried so far, but that shower filter might just be number one. I've never used a shower filter like that. And I just feel like it makes such a big difference in my shower routine and my hair just feels so good. And it has great benefits for your skin as well, which I think is amazing. Okay, I'm going with the pronunciation Trust for these products. So this is a full Trust curly hair routine. I have their curly enhancing leave-in conditioner. I have their aqua gel and also their gloss shine. So those are the products I'm gonna use today. So first I'm going in with this curl enhancing leave-in conditioner and it says it's a volume reducer, which I'm a little bit confused about, but I think it might mean like frizziness. So maybe it means like frizziness reducer it also says it gives curl control softness and shine and then in the back it does say it's an anti-frizz leave-in so I think that's what it means by volume reducing normally when I do my hair I like to have a lot of volume so we're gonna see how this turns out the consistency is a little bit runny but I do like that it's a really lightweight product so I don't think it's gonna weigh my hair down at all and I feel like so far all their products pretty much smell the same and I'm just raking this product through all over without separating my hair I'm adding a little bit more for the other side of my head. It definitely has a lot of slip and it's making it super easy to run my fingers through my hair. It feels really good. So next I'm going to apply this aqua gel and I'm going to apply this one in sections. This one says it has moderate shine, does not contain any alcohol or plastic residue, which is always good. It has a 2 out of 5 hold. It says 5 out of 5 shine and then 3 out of 5 volume. So I'm going to go ahead and split my hair probably in 3 sections to apply this. And then let's see the consistency of this gel. I really like a lightweight gel and I feel like this is pretty lightweight. You guys can see how it's running down my hand like that. So, so far both these products are really lightweight and that's good for my hair because the lighter the products are, the more volume I'll get in my hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply this by raking and scrunching. This also has like a, I don't know, it smells like fresh, like a fresh like rain scent or something, like a very clean and fresh scent. It definitely smells a little bit different than the leave-in conditioner, but if you're big on fragrance or scents, or like if you're sensitive to them, these are all pretty subtle, they're not super strong. So that's another thing I like about these products because I'm not a big fan of super strong fragrances or scents in my hair products. I'm gonna be adding a little more to every section. Okay, so my camera ended up dying, but I finished applying all the gel all over my hair. And I just wanna remind you guys that you can find all the products that I used in this video today on the Verge Beauty website. And I'll have their link in the description box below. You can also use my code that I'll put right here on the screen to save some money. And you can even split your payments into four interest-free payments using Klarna, which makes it a super easy and convenient way to start your new hair journey and stock up on some products that you are going to love. So my hair is about 50% dry right now, and I do have a little bit of a cast, but the gel that I use was a light hold gel so I wasn't expecting it to be too hard too crunchy but the cast will help prevent a little bit of frizz when I start diffusing my hair so for my diffusing routine I always like to hover diffuse first and then I'll start scrunching when my hair is a little bit more dry to get some more volume So this is what my hair looks like completely dry but before I fluff it out and to fluff it out I'm going to apply some of this gloss shine 
also from the brand Truce, into my hands. So this gloss shine is a split ends binding serum and also helps prevent frizz. I love to put oil in my hands before I start running my hands through my hair after it's been diffused to prevent frizz. So this helps protect the hair from dryness and gives you a frizz free look. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of this in my hands. Let's see the consistency of this. Here we go. Okay, so it's kind of thick. I'm just putting a tiny bit in my hands. I don't want to put too much. Yeah, it's definitely a little thicker than I expected, but that's okay. I'm just not going to apply too much. It smells so good. It smells so good. So I'm also going to put this on the back of my hands since I'm going to like rake my hands through my hair and I want it all to be covered. I'm going to put a little bit of this on my hair like this. This feels so nice and smooth. And then I'm gonna start fluffing it out. So I'm just gonna shake it. I'm gonna put my hands in my roots and shake from the root. It's still a little bit damp. It's always a little bit damp by the nape of my neck. It's like the last place my hair likes to dry, but I think it should be good. I have so much definition in my hair. It looks amazing, honestly. This is the best wash day I could have started 2023 with. These are pretty much my final results after using all the products from Verge Beauty. I love the way my hair came out. I especially love the way that it feels so much. I'm so happy I was introduced to these new products that I will for sure be incorporating into future routines. Don't forget to check out Verge Beauty in the description box below and go shop for some new products for your hair journey this year. Also, let me know what your hair goals are this year i know my goal this year one of my goals every year is to let my hair grow even though i keep cutting it i still want my hair to be super super long so don't ever let me cut my hair again if you're watching this tell me no if i ever mention it one more time so yeah hair growth is definitely a goal of mine leave a comment down below letting me know what your hair goal of the year is and thank you guys so so much for watching i'll see you guys all in my next video bye